So today, I'm gonna be doing a review on my survival kit, or like everything that's in it. So if I go in the woods in like an emergency situation or something, I take this, so let's get right into it. All right, so on this survival kit, it's in this waterproof box with this handle, and then there's a code lock right there that you can spin, and then you just unlock it. So I'm gonna do the code right now. And then you just pull it open like that. And this is the kit. Oh, wow, doesn't that look sweet? All right, so on this side, this is kind of like my fire stuff. So in this compartment, I have a bunch of toilet paper. I use that for fire starting. And then here's the actual stuff I use. I have matches, a lighter, and then I have this little chapstick which I think is waterproof, with some matches and a little striker. And then in here, I have a little med medicine pill thing, thing, and I have a little bundle of paracord, and then I have some matches in there with a little striker that you can do it on. And then underneath that, I have some more toilet paper for starting the fire. All right, so this middle container is just like miscellaneous, and I think, no, that chocolate bar doesn't go in there. That looks kind of good, I'm gonna eat it right now. Uh, it looks really good. Mmm, that's really good. Back to the straw thing. Salt and pepper, it's normally full. Waterproof case with some batteries in it. Little Altoids tin, mint tin. With some meds, band-aids, and some cream. Multi-tool. Another multi-tool. You can never have way too many knives. Or fire starters. And then I have a little piece of leather. Just in case you like cut your finger, you can wrap it up. And then use the paracord to like strap it on to keep it like protected. And there's a little paper clip. Right here, I have this little thing that you can put for collecting tinder for starting a fire. I think it's waterproof. I don't think so. Paracord bracelet. Neon. You can like flash a plane down with this. You just go, ah. I think it glows in dark. Two carabiners. Some more leather for a bigger wound. If you cut your arm or something, you can just slap that on, tie it on. Just like that. And down in here, I have a couple more carabiners. And there's this little, it's called a um, wallet knife. It's so thin, you can almost put it in your wallet. And then right here, I got this little compass. You can open it up like that. And it has a little magnifying glass and then like this compass thingy. So yeah, that's that compass. So in this compartment, extra paracord just tied up. I have some mini cord stuff. Some duct tape, it's always nice. Some camp soap, Coleman. I have a little sewing kit with some thread and needles and some paper, um, some paper clips and a little mini fishing kit. I have another little mini multi-tool with a little keychain so you can clip it on. And another multi-tool if you need to like pull out a splinter or like rip off your nails and rip out your teeth. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. That was a joke. So yeah, there's that. And then I have this whistle. It's really loud. Ow, my ears really hurt. Ah, oh, that kind of hurt. Another whistle. And it has the temperature and another mini compass. So that's nice. And I have a little, um, a little thumb compass. Just in case you, so you can compare the other ones. And I have some wire and some snare cord if you want to make like a trap. 
And right here I have a bandana. A bandana is always nice for like filtering water. If you fold it like five times, like this, how it's folded, and then put it over a bottle and then pour the nasty water through it, it'll collect some of the big stuff. I have this other little mini knife for like carving and stuff. And right here, I think this is for like signaling a plane or it's a magnifying glass for starting a fire. And then this is a mirror for signaling a plane. So, yeah. And I got some tweezers, a little pencil, really small. Some tin foil if I need to boil some water. And right here, this is a blade. My mom gave it to me. She's a nurse, so she has that. It's really sharp. If you need to like cut out something that you like stepped on a rock and it went really far in your foot, you might need that in a survival situation. You could use the wire and attach it to a stick. And then right in here, I have some paper for the little pencil I showed you, just in case you want to like write down your thoughts and stuff. All right, guys. So that was the end. That's my whole survival kit. I hope you enjoyed this awesome kit. So, yeah, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment, all that sweet stuff. And see you guys in the next video. Peace out.